Hi, you guys. Hello, hello, hello. Today is April 29, 2017, 7.26 in the p.m. And this is going to be a Big Lots haul. Spent uh, about $200 at Big Lots. Someone's already digging around the bags. Let me get, you, get started by showing you a new dog bed. And I got one of these and there's more. <laughs> he wanted something to drink, apparently. A new, oh. a new dog bed for Lucy the Chihuahua. Um, I needed to replace a few of her beds and she really liked the one that I got her, I guess, last month. So I went ahead and got her a repiece. An identical one. Yeah, identical. She really did like that. She was super happy about that. I needed to replace some sheets. So, uh, bought some black sheets. These are, have a really cool, I don't know if you guys can see the, yeah, there you can kind of see the design. It's kind of got stripes. These just go in, uh, I'll see at the angle. And then, I think, oh yeah, yeah all right there, there you go. You can see it, it yeah, through the plastic. Yeah. See, yeah, it's pretty. Can cool. go put those in your room. Got a outdoor fun metal badminton set with a couple of shuttlecocks. Oh yes. <laughs> so we're gonna be taking this to the beach and to the park and having fun with that. Jay wanted some fun dip, so I got him some fun dip. I got uh, myself and the bathroom some Cottonelle Fresh Care uh, Clean Ripple Flushable Wipes because sometimes that is what's needed in your life. I got myself a LA Colors Volume Lash Mascara in black. I also got myself some 32 Triangle Cosmetic Sponges. I'm going to be using these in the art area. I got myself some Blendy Coconut Chips Chocolate Flavored. I tried these um, just, I think, last week, and oh, they're amazingly delicious. So I had to repeat purchase this item because, yeah, they were good. Got the little Wawa some Milk Bone Minis. These are peanut butter flavored. She's right here and super excited. She'll be doing a little taste test of these probably over on her channel. There she is. She's like, ooh. Okay, what? Okay, what? Okay, what? Okay, what? That's what you want. Yeah, yeah. that's what you want. <laughs> Alright, so this stuff was done. That one's empty. Pull this over here. I got myself a couple little snacks from the Bimbo, Bimbo, Bimba, Bumbo, blah, 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 blah. I don't know how to pronounce it, but I do enjoy their croissant rolls. Super tasty, nice little treat for myself. And I also got. Sorry, accidentally pressed the play button. There we go. Um, also got um, their. Uh, this is their cinnamon um, raisin bread, which I really like. It is super, super delicious. Like it so very much. These things gonna need to go into the kitchen. So I'll put those over here. Also got a back scrubber for my bathroom, and then I got Jay one for his bathroom. So everybody can have clean backs. Got a couple of cat toys for Lucy because she is so little that she actually prefers to play with the smaller toys. So got her a strawberry and a banana toy right here, and then also. A couple of little critter toys on a stick, which she will have a lot of fun. She has no idea. She has no, 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 no. She has no idea that she got anything. She won't know until later because I want to make sure and film her reaction when she sees it for the first time. So That's she knows no something's fun. up, but she doesn't quite know no what. I got this very delicious smelling candle that has, I believe, a it's either a wooden or a burlap um, wick, and it smells like pine, it's very nice. I also got myself some uh, wax melts. This is a pine scented one and there was another one, here it is. And this one is a pecan. Both of them smell really good and they were also on clearance for 25 cents a piece and I couldn't beat that. The candle was on clearance for $3, normally $11.99, so not bad. And these are normally, 
a dollar. So they were knocked down to 25 cents. Heck of a deal, I think. Got myself some Dr. Teal's Pure Epsom Salt. This is the coconut oil one. I have not tried this brand yet. I've tried this brand. I have not tried this version of this brand. Um, so I'm actually extremely excited to give this one a try. I'll be reviewing a lot of these products you're seeing here today on my review channel um, once that happens. Also, I got the Eucalyptus and Spearmint one. I don't know if I've tried this one. I believe I may have tried it at some point in the past, but I know for a fact I have never reviewed it. So I will give it another try and do a review video on that one. Got myself a set of Fila Women All Sports socks. Just a standard pair of the little short ankled socks. Another version of the Dr. Teal's. This one is Detoxifying and Energize with Ginger and Clay. Now I've never seen this one before or tried it, so I'm excited about trying this one. As you can tell, I'm a fan of the Epsom salts. Our um, smoke detector has been beeping and driving us nuts, so we got some batteries for that. Jay, you want to go ahead and actually get that taken care of so we don't have to hear it beeping anymore? I got myself two nail polishes. Um, both of them are Sinful Colors brand. No, no, not both of them are. One of them is Sinful Colors brand. The other one is called Transforming Effects. And it is called Golden Confetti. And it's a gold glitter. And then this one is called... Hmm, can't even tell. It's too... It's just a really light, peachy, fleshy color. I can't read what exactly the name of it is, though. Whoa! Also, uh, Jay spotted this. I thought this was a good idea. It's a keep dry pouch for your smartphone. So if you're at the beach or if you're at a water park or anywhere where there may be a situation where your phone has um, ex been, you know, potentially going to be exposed to water, this is not a bad thing to just have fold it up and carry in your purse or in your car. So definitely going to have this as a just a carry item in my purse just in case. Because you never know. I was almost out of Kleenex, so I got myself a pack of four boxes of Kleenex. I need to transplant um, one of the plants that I have out back. So I did buy myself a new planter for that. Here's another bag and empty. So here is the new planter that I got for that. And then I got the little rolling tray for underneath it. So that way it kept, kept, catches any dripping or mess that might occur. I got Chihuahua, a brand new raised, and this is purple colored food and water dish. Um, these are a little bit raised up off the ground. I think that's going to be a little bit better. Also, I got myself a head wrap, and this is one that has just a little Velcro. So when I get in the tub or anything, I can just quickly, easily wrap my hair and get it up and out of the way. All right. Almost done. Two more bags to go. My goodness. Alright. I got some probiotics, but I didn't get those from Big Lots, so I'm not going to include them in this haul. We got an anchor away. This is a way to safely secure umbrellas into the ground. It'll be perfect for going to the beach, and what you do is you just drill this into the sand, and then it gives you a good port to... Uh, put an umbrella or anything else that you may need to stabilize them. So I figured this would be a good item just to have in the trunk of the car from when we go to the beach. We'll be prepared. Oh my goodness, here's the long ass receipt. Which we need to fill out their little survey thing so we can potentially win. Walgreens had the a survey thing on theirs too, so here if you wouldn't mind. I think our big lots is better than the one we just went through. And, I don't know, maybe. Hard to tell. Yeah. Got myself a new beach towel because I do love a good beach towel uh, for my hair, especially with as thin as beach towels are. They're really, really good and easy for me to wrap my hair and such. So, excited about that. And it has cutesy fishies on it, which I like. 
couple more cans of Arizona sweet tea for Mr. J. Here you go, Mr. J. If you wouldn't mind, will you put this two things in the on the counter in there? Oh, and there's another one right there. <laughs> I got myself some Orchard's Peak Coconut Water. I have not tried this before. This is a not from Concentrate. I will be doing a review, a taste test and review video of that. Jay got some Welch's Fruit and Yogurt Snacks. He's a big fan of those. Yeah, they're real good. I got myself some Crispy Coconut Rolls. I had tried these before, um, just a couple of weeks ago. I bought them for a taste test. and. Woo, they're delicious. They're very, very good. So good that I got them again. So I'm excited about having those to snack on again. Oh, I didn't notice you put some zebra cakes in the bag. So Jay got himself some zebra cakes. Mm -hmm. Oh, you? I picked out some organic fruit flavored snacks. They are kind of like a, a gel snack. I got the berry cherry one and then also the strawberry apple one so i'll be doing taste tests of these as well on my review channel we'll see how that goes also i got myself some california almonds natural whole these are unsalted and roasted they're just raw unsalted almonds just as something healthy to snack on i also got some um Sea salt caramel flavor coconut chips. I do not 100% know if I've tried these or not. Um, I've tried one similar, but I don't know if I've tried these brand, this brand specifically of this flavor. So I'm gonna look into that and see. If I haven't, I'll do a review of that. I know I haven't tried this. It is Glendy Coconut Snack Bites. And this is chocolate flavored. I have definitely not tried these, so I'll be doing a review of this for sure. Uh, so. We got here another one of the same brand but different flavor. This is the honey flavor. I'm actually really excited about the honey flavor because I think I might like those. Uh, this is some Placey's candies. It's old fashioned hard candy root beer. I used to love these as a child so I felt like it'd be fun to get them again. I could do a taste test, a review video of it and just you know reminisce about days gone past. I, uh, Old Orchard, 100% organic juice, peach and mango. It looked interesting. I don't know if I'm gonna like it. I will be doing a taste test. Hey Jay, will you take some of this food away? Please, sir. And then we'll just continue on. I got a Body Ecology Pure White Gardenia Bath Moms. So excited about trying that. And I'll be definitely doing a review of that one. Thank you, sir. Some uh, replacement cleaning cloths, flushable wipes. Got some more packs of that, so there'll be one in the other bathroom as well. Jay got a new bath scrunchie. <laughs> I got also, right here. Thank you. Um, this is Dead Sea Salt or Dead Sea Bath Salts with Dead Sea Salts with almond and vanilla oil. I have never seen this brand before, so I'm excited to give this one a try. Yes, I got lots of goodies for the bath. Another thing for the WA, WA. She's looking right now. Hold on. <laughs> Blocking it from her so she can't see. She's looking straight at me like, what are you She's not here? seeing, she's not seeing, but yes, this is going to be for, on her channel, she'll do a little review of that. Alright, four more things you guys, and then we're done, we're done! Alright, the Curious Creamery Customizable Ice Cream Mix, create your own flavor. It is a, some kind of make your own ice cream at home with just the ingredients in this pack, I guess some cream or milk or something, and then a freezer. Water, water oh, only a water? I think so. This is gonna be a taste test video and a review video of this product. Oh, this, this one would be one I would say definitely 
try to watch when I post it because I think this is gonna be sketchy as fuck. <laughs> Last three things that I got. Three flavors of Mike and Ike's that I haven't tried and that caught my eye. One is Mike and Ike cotton candy. Of course, these will all be reviewed on my review channel. Mike and Ike cherry cola and Mike and Ike root beer flavor. Alright, you guys, let me know if you're someone who shops at Big Lots. If you are, uh, let me know what you normally get there. Do you get household items? Do you get grocery items? Do you get a combination of a little bit of everything? Uh, we actually went down every single aisle because that was how I was getting my steps in today. And yep, I'm almost there. I'm at 4,802 steps. Hi right, guys, thanks so much for watching. Let me know if you have a Big Lots in your area and if it's a place that you shop at in the comment section below and I'll see you in the next video. And by the way, I'll put a link below to Big Lots so anyone who's curious to see if there's a location near you, you can find out by clicking that link. Thanks for watching. Bye.